How'd you get on board with the Aurora? We just swam around until we found it. Oh, wait, there's an upper deck. Never mind. I'm an idiot. We can go this way. Are there any, like, stealable or useful things up here? Open your fucking eyes and look around once in a while, Pete. Be surprised what you might find. I mean, in this case, specifically, we found a dead end. Can we go down? Yes. Give me a little flashlight action here. Uh, there's a lot of pipes, though. This seems like a lot of work. All kinds of pipes and tubes and shit. Actually, that flashlight is really useful. I don't actually want my sea glide here. The flashlight is what I want. Swap me out for that sweet flashlight, actually. Is the battery dead? It's got a dead battery. We'll swap it out. There we go. Oh, that's much better. So the flashlight is like the greatest thing since... I'm not going to say sliced bread, but it's pretty awesome. Mostly I'm not going to say sliced bread because sliced bread isn't that fucking remarkable. It's just bread that somebody cut with a knife. If that that's really, like, that's it, huh, folks? That's as far as we've gotten in the last several thousand years. Is That's still the be-all, end-all, huh? Just a slice of the bread. It seems like there's something in this. Get rid of the laser cutter for now and give me my propulsion cannon back. I want to move this box. Because I feel like there's something inside this that's going to be... Nope. Nothing at all. Alright. Well. We learned nothing. A lot of trash and a pl- <gasps> What is that? There's some kind of sweet suit or they're, they're all- Oh, I got- I gotta steal one of these suits. I want one like I've never wanted anything in my young life. Pete, you're neither young and you're barely alive. These are both truisms, but I still want one of these fucking suits. How do I get- I gotta get up here. Nope. Alright, we're gonna have to propulsion cannon the shit out of some stuff then. Propulsion cannon, make me a path. Get that shit out of here. Those boxes do not float. They should float. Don't float. Get out of here. Can I scan any of this stuff? Nope, I can scan myself. It's been a while since we self-scanned. Maybe we should uh, take a little peep at it. You should go scan one of those suits. I don't know if we can get close enough to scan one, can we? That's a good idea, though, chat. Let's go try it. I'm moving real slow in my fins. Can we get close enough to scan? Maybe we can. <gasps> We've done it. A prawn suit? I must have more. How do I get you? No, more prawn suit, please. The noble, the powerful, the mighty prawn. I will make his power my own. Are there more prawn suit fragments down here? I want more prawn suit. The mighty prawn. Both powerful and delicious, I might add. We do not appear to be any more prawn suit fragments down here. I, th I think we got them all. A lot of trash floating in the water, though. We take only pictures, people. Leave only footprints. Well, we got all the prawn suits. Let's keep exploring. Did Pete find a blueprint for the submarine? I have the little submarine. The sea moth, that I've got the blueprint for. I found enough chunks of that. What are you? But you're scannable. Nope, you're just on fire. All right, then. Maybe go around the fire. What else have we got? Cargo box. A sweet nutrient block. I may just eat that. Is any of this stuff scannable? Some filtered water. That I'm just going to drink. Another nutrient block. Man, this place is crawling with nutrient blocks. 
Honestly, I'd prefer water to nutrient blocks. More water? Yep. Give me that. Just drink the water. There we go. A bar table? Hell yeah! Also, if this place had a bar, like, that's pretty awesome. A vending machine? Yeah! Also, since I'm on a planet all by myself and everybody's dead, is there, like, anybody who's gonna object to me kicking open this vending machine and making off with all of the cheese nibs? Because that's my current plan, is to just steal all the cheese nibs. I'm just gonna scan everything. Single wall shelf, get scanned. How about old beer bottle? Can I acquire it? I wanna... Yes! I want the cat poster. Another abandoned PDA. You know, a fire extinguisher probably wouldn't hurt. This door does not open. This door does not open. This door also does not open. Go around the fire. It's in you. Disinfect them. Everybody's real worried about the bacterial content of their water. So what? It's a little alien bacteria. Big deal. Just drink it already, you crybaby. What are you so worried about? Drink the water. Can I steal this photo? I want the photo of the hot chick so I have something to masturbate to besides photos of fish. I need, I need some masturbatory material. I want this. A poster of the prawn suit. Yes. Also a sweet bench. Another PDA. Relationship contract legal recording. We're going into cabin seven. Our inventory's a little full. Do I still have that peeper? Eat that. I just ate a decomposing... Oh, decomposing peeper is not a thing you should eat. Did we get all the fire? We got all the fire. So we got a battery. Interesting. Just an empty storage compartment. Can I... Wait, can I scan you? Another abandoned PDA. Another battery. New PDA data. I'm really more concerned about my inventory, actually. I'm gonna eat one of those nutrient blocks. We found the bench, now we just gotta find Teddy. Are we doing naughty, naughty dolphin things yet? Well, I mean, you know, it's really only a matter of time, Chad. We're alone on a planet. We did, uh... Find a sweet prawn suit. What's in you? Open storage. It is empty. I want one of these carry-alls, but I can't take it. It says inventory full. Is that a way for me to get more carry in my carry, though? Okay, what if I do this? What if I open the carry-all and stick a microscope and, like, maybe a couple of these batteries in here? And then maybe my sweet posters. And the nutrient block. Can I then just pick this up? Bag is not empty, cannot pick up. So how does the carry-all work? If we drop this, just drop you. Can I pick up the carry-all? Yes. Once the carry-all is in my inventory... Inventory full. Once it's in my inventory, though, can I... Put stuff in it? The answer is no. Alright, well, I'm... I care very much less about you suddenly. We can always come back if we really want to carry all, I suppose. Sea Glide, you're supposed to be on two. Fire extinguisher, I mean, I don't really have There's nothing else really we're interested in over here. Okay, what other rooms haven't we been into? 
You haven't been this way. I can tell because it's all still on fire. I know how to use a fire extinguisher, chat. You aim at the base of the fire, pull the pin, depress the lever, spray, and sweep back and forth. Can we not get into cabin five? I don't need any more nutrient blocks. They're just taking up space. Give me my propulsion gun. Can I pull this shit out of the way? Nope, it is not propulsionable. a bowl. Another battery. What appears to be... Oh, a you know what? A first aid kit? We'll just use one. Any of this stuff we haven't scanned already? An empty storage. More disinfected water. We actually can't carry any more disinfected water because our inventory is full. Okay, so we're out of room. Oh, but there's a poster. Natural selection poster. How can I not naturally select it? All right, fire extinguisher. You're almost spent anyway. Give me this poster. I got to spruce up the homestead, man. That poster is going to go a long way towards making me feel more at home. We fully explored this hallway. It was less than exciting. This is where we came in. Have we been over here? No. We probably have a PDA that will give us the code for that. We'll look at that in a minute. Are you empty or full, carry-all? I just want to open you. You're empty. You're empty. They're like Perfidious Pete. They're all empty inside. They're all empty and hollow. Dead. Oh, man. Another sweet prawn poster. Want the posters, though. We already have a prawn suit poster, and we're already full on food and water. We can't care. You know what? We can always come back for it. We can always come back for it. Do we know the code... Vehicles. Prawn. Mark three. Yeah, I know I want one. Today's menu. Indigenous life forms. Public documents. Additional technical. Do we have a code for this place? Today's menu? I don't know. Okay. We gotta find a code for cabin one. That's our goal. Also... We can't extinguish the electricity, unfortunately. All of these cabins require codes. That's the captain's ca Oh, I gotta raid the captain's cabin. I can find the captain's log in there. I want to look at his old poop. Cabin one. We don't have we don't have codes for any of this stuff. The game isn't exactly stingy with the fire extinguisher, so. You're empty. Drop you. Okay, get extinguished. This is where we came in, because I remember scanning all this stuff. Is this the end of the road, then? There's got to be more stuff than this. We came in here, empty fire extinguisher. We emptied it. Captain's cabin, which we can't rob, but are desperate to rob. Oh, codes and clues section. Right. Thanks, chat. Good call. Um, codes and clues. Lab access, which we already opened. Life pod six, transmission origin, which we already found. Notes to self. We have a cargo bay code, one, four, five, four. Does any of these go to the cargo bay? Cabin, so that's a no. Cabin two, captain's cabin. None of these appear to go to the bay, to the cargo bay, chat. 
canteen, supply closet. This also seems like it is the cargo bay, maybe. There's a door over there we didn't go through. We can always come back. Codes for the cabin should be found in miscellaneous other cabins. Locker room. Use a repair tool. I have a repair tool. See, it's right here. Ragnarokai, hey, welcome to the stream. We're repairing this door so we don't have to just blast it like Han Solo. Also, why couldn't I just blast it like Han Solo? Because, well, I'm mostly because I don't have a blaster, I guess. Is there anything beyond this fire or any reason to put it out? The answer is no. We'll just let it burn. Then. Another battery. You know, we got... I think we're good in the battery department for now. Thanks, game. I appreciate you wanting to me have an ample supply of ever-readies, but we're good. Like, we've got all the batteries we need for a little while. None of this stuff appears to be scannable or interactable. We can chop that door open, though. We don't need that health kit. We're not too... We're not hurt, and we have two in our inventory. Well, time to chop a hole in this bad boy. Give me my laser cutter out. Get somebody about to get cut! Remember playing this game before the release? You wish your laptop could run it. It really is visually stunning now. I'm sure it has unfortunate consequences for, like, the GPU requirements, but I got a pretty hoss rig, so... I have to say, I'm really enjoying the visuals. The game looks gorgeous. Get my knife out. You always have your knife in hand in case of head crabs, Chad. You never know where those little bastards are lurking. They could be anywhere. Please tell me I can scan a forklift. I want a forklift for my base. God damn it. I wanted a forklift for my base, man. Come on. Why can't I have a nice, sweet forklift that I could drive through the wall and crash into shit? How come I can't have nice things? All I wanted was one sweet-ass forklift. The game's like, nah, Pete, you don't get a forklift. Another nutrient block. I guess they were really worried that we were going to starve to death. Either that or everybody on the Aurora was just morbidly obese. Ah, we just sit around eating these nutrient blocks all day, Pete. No time to burn off calories here. We got to uh, down nutrient blocks. More disinfected water. I'm just going to start drinking some of this shit. We're just over here eating these sweet-ass nutrient blocks all day. Got about 9,000 calories a nutrient block a day I'm taking in here. Makes it really tough to hit your step goal, I'm not going to lie. Plus, the Aurora isn't that big, so... I don't suppose you have a code or a clue in you, do you? I really just want to figure out how I'm supposed to get into those cabins. Jumping puzzle? Oh. Wait, was there a PDA over here? No, I was looking at my own swim fins. Bunch of cargo. Man, these guys got a lot of just general cargo. Like enough they could start their own cult. Do you think peepers have developed cargo cults yet, Chad? I mean, the Aurora did come from on high. I can scan. Oh, it's self scan. The Aurora did come from on high and bring an abundance of cargo that it just let strewn about. Sort of like the old World War II era cargo cults. I'm thinking maybe we have spawned one amongst like the peepers and Gary fish. Especially the Gary fish, because you know that Gary, he's a lazy fuck. Guy didn't want to do anything. Sitting around eating nutrient blocks all day. How do I open you? Oh, is it that easy? Just push the button? Wait, what way did you enter the ship? Uh, I don't know, from like the underneath-ish chat? I don't really know how to describe it. There was a big, very angry looking fish man swimming around down there, and we came in the way that required us to not fight the fish man. 
we hurled some crap out of the way with our propulsion cannon like we're about to do right here. Can I move this desk? After we hurled the junk out of the way. We're looking for cabin codes right now. Mostly. Seems like we've been here before. Airlocks. We didn't... Is this the way... This is the way we came in, is it? I mean, we've clearly been here before. Is this the way we came in, Chuck? Yeah, this is the way we came in. Never mind. This is where we came in at. So, there you go. There's the answer to your question. Head back to the prawn bay. We're going to explore everywhere, chat. Settle down. we got to go to, like, administration, because that's the place we haven't been yet. I don't think. Did we go this way? No, we didn't go this way. Or did we? Never mind. We totally went this way. Another sweet prawn suit poster. All right. We did come this way. So we've been to administration. We're going back to Cargo Bay 3. Back to Cargo Bay 3. Huh? Huh? Oh. Suddenly I'm superhuman and I can just hurl these boxes out of my way physically. Yeah, beat it. Come on, stop box. Like, fuck off. Huh? You're making me waste energy on my sweet propulsion gun and it doesn't have that much. I mean, we have 8 trillion extra batteries, so it's not really that big of a deal, but... So this is where the cargo bay access code probably was supposed to be used, because this is very clearly the cargo bay. Yeah. Ow. Why am I hurt? Also, there doesn't really seem to be much of anything in the cargo bay. So then we'll go down this way. Jack shit here. Huh? There's nothing in here. Drive room. That's what was Seamoth Bay. Hold on a second. We're going to repair the tool the shit out of this. You know, the one tool we're not really using right now is our Sea Glide. Let's replace that with a more useful tool. There's more prawn to scan. Okay, settle down, chat. I want the prawn too. We'll get we'll find it. See, look, there's a piece of something right here. What the hell are you? A sea moth. We already have the sea moth though. Yeah, I tried to make titanium that we couldn't carry. VR sweet downlog. Sweet downlog! Yeah, give me that. I must know how to build a VR suite. Never mind. It's just a chat log of a survival game. In your survival game, a chat log of a survival game. Very droll. No signal. What are you? Seamoth Deep... Oh, yeah. we No, we want the Seamoth Depth module, though. Give me that. Is there anything else we can get? Bay 1? Bay 2. Are you something? Just wall textures. Another Seamoth fragment. I don't even want to scan it, actually. Oh, we could get the whole Seamoth here. There are three fragments of the Seamoth right in this room. But we already have the Seamoth. So I'm actually not going to scan them. Drive room. It's down this way. Prawn bay and a locker room. This is the where this is where we came from, though. This is the locker room. Oh, I bet there are okay, there are gonna be PDAs in here. Data downloads. Auxiliary mission orders. Yeah, I'm looking for codes, though, game. Like cabin codes. Tell me how to break into people's rooms so that I can rob them. That's what I want to know. How do I commit larceny? Theft. This is what Perfidious Pete is looking for here. I want to steal stuff. Everybody's dead, so technically it's not actually stealing. 
Okay, so this is the prawn bay. So we're looking for chunks of the prawn suit. Maybe they're down in the water or something. Let's look for anything scannable. And these are just pipes and tubes. This is the way we came in. Go around the electricity. I don't see any prawn pieces, chat. Just fucking endless series of tubes. Actually, I'm lost in going to suffocate now. This, this part right here actually strikes a significant legitimate fear for me, because I have a, like, real, like, terror of drowning. How did we get over here? I didn't swim through the electricity, I know that. Did I go over it? I must have gone over it. Okay, whew. I don't see any more pieces of a prawn suit anywhere, though. Just a bunch of cargo containers that we already looked at. The fiery rubble? Check out the fiery rubble. But it's on fire, Jet. Oh, here we go. Oh, shit. Oh, God. We're burning alive. Alright, that did not tickle. Are you a prawn? You're a prawn. Get, get scanned, though. Get, get scanned, though. That one is not scannable. What about this one? Are you scannable? Yeah, get scanned. Alright, we've done it. We can make ourselves our very own prawn suit. There's no signal there, though. So we found the prawn suit. How do I break into these cabins, though? I want to break into these cabins. I must steal. I can't not thieve. How do I thieve you? So we're looking for PDA fragments. Something that's going to give us a code. Are you water? I want to steal. When was the last time Pete committed perfidy? I don't know, probably the last time we played PUBG and I shot one of my teammates for no real good reason. But uh, take your time. I mean, we are in a bedroom chat. You know, I think maybe we'll take a quick time out for a little uh, self-scan, if you know what I mean. Oh, uh, yeah, that's the good stuff right there. I want to rob the captain's cabin because you know the captain is keeping all of the best booze for himself. I want the captain's booze. Bastard was holding out on us. Well, alright. Maybe they're back somewhere we haven't been yet. Huh? Self-scans on the bed, immediately finds out he's infected. Yeah, it's just like uh, Tara Reed's story, basically. Self-scan on the bed, infection discovered, the Tara Reed story. I feel like the locker room is the place we would find these codes.
Nope, they're not in here. So we haven't been to the drive room yet. We have been to the Seamoth Bay. We got the whole Seamoth. This goes back the way we came. All right, let's go check out the drive room. Screw you, I'm attempting it. Ouch. Wow, that fire doesn't fuck around, though, huh? You probably found the correct PDAs already. I mean, if we go into the codes thing, it doesn't have us... It doesn't have any codes, though. Codes and clues. We have lab access, notes to self. That This is it. Lab access, life pod transmission, and notes to self. That That's it. We have no codes for those cabins. They could just not be on the Aurora, too. I mean, it's possible they're somewhere else. Found the correct PDAs already, you just didn't read them. Unless it's an indigenous life form, we've read everything. Life pod six. Yeah, so, I mean, fill a PDA in a locker room that you missed. We'll go back for it. What is this? Cyclops efficiency module. I want that. Warning, local radiation at maximum tolerable level. Also, you know what? Use a med kit. I'd rather not die. So we need to repair this stuff. We've scanned the breach. Let's repair it. There are only 10 more. Oh, good. Alright, let's find and fix all these breaches. Usually the breaches are, like, spewing shit into the water. Which doesn't really seem healthy, by the way. Oh shit, There's these are dickfish. Come here, dickfish. Get cut. You and your little asshole friend. Y'all getting sliced. Be slicing like it's Dexter's Kitchen come breakfast time. Ow, he's on me! Get off of me. This place is crawling with these little maggot bastards. Ah, get off of me! Who else wants some? The little shit? Get off of me. Is that it? No, we missed at least one. Oh, they're eating each other! Alright, I think we got them all. Back to fixing shit. Yeah, I mean, I can count. You said there were seven breaches and I repaired one. I'm not a mathematician, but I can do simple subtraction, lady. Also, why is this breach not fixable? Yep, yep that, that's true. There are five left. And when I repair this one, guess how many will be left, lady? I'm going to go with four. There will likely be four breaches left once I have fixed this one. Oh, turns out four. Probably three further breaches after I fix this one. Call me crazy. Oh, she had three. It's, it's as if, if I was rudimentarily capable. Yep, two of them. I see one of them sparking over here in the distance. Apparently when they said, make sure that you're a qualified personnel, the qualification was capable of simple addition and subtraction. That's literally the one qualification you need to repair the reactor. 
Well, that and, like, possessing a repair tool. There are technically two qualifications. Possess a repair tool, be able to subtract one from ten, ten times. Okay, radiation levels complete. Or finished, or fixed, or whatever the hell we can do. Sorted is the word I'm looking for here. Alright, so we managed to seal the breach. Now what? Can we get over to that other... Can we get up on that platform? Because I want to see if maybe there's like a Cyclops mod up there. This one had a Cyclops mod. Does this one? And is there any way for us to get up there? We can probably get up over here. Oh, there's more ship to explore, too. Nope, that's actually just a flaming fucking wreck, though. Anything over here? Not a damn thing. Is that a dead... Oh, I thought that was a dead body. The Count from Sesame Street wants his job back. The computer crowding in on his sidekick. One old breach. Ah, ah, ah. Two old breaches. Ah, ah, ah. We are running out of fire extinguisher here. Oh, go out, fire. I think we got it all. We got it all. Oh, wait. Isn't this the way we came in? This is the way we came in, though, I think. Isn't it? Locker room, prawn bay. This is absolutely the way we came in. I have put out an extraneous fire. Is there another exit then to the drive room? Or does it just have the one way in and out? Oh, the drive room is just a box. It just has the one way in and out. Unless there's something over here behind this. Nope, there's nothing over here behind this. Just a giant fire. Well, alright. Nothing to see here, then. So we've been everywhere. Chat says I missed a PDA in a locker room. Alright, chat. We'll go back and get it. Ordinarily, I wouldn't care. But in this case, I do really want to steal the captain's booze. So let's go back to the locker room. I gotta get my hands on the captain's booze. Uh, locker room is this way then? Yep. Okay, so there's one PDA in here that I have missed. Chat says I missed one. Oh, here we go. It's on the upper shelf. Sweet offer. Integrating new PDA data. Come by cabin number one. The code is 1869. All right. Now we can go and steal. Now I'm happy. Who is this captain? You have a note talking about his birthday. Maybe it's his birthday. Nobody's that unimaginable in the distant future chat. People have more sense about password security than just making it their birthday. I refuse to believe that. Nobody's that dumb, especially in the future. And so what was that code again? 1869. I do appreciate his 69 sensibilities, though. You got the good booze in here? Where's the good booze? Responsible autonomous relationships. Drive core shielding breach we already covered. Something about responsible autonomous some shit. Should be in our databank, but isn't? 
You know what? I hardly care. It didn't say this is where the captain keeps his sweet booze. What if the future is like idiocracy, though, and everybody's just dumb? Pick up a blue cap. Well, yes, I'm taking that. Arcade George toy. Uh, well, that feels like a must-have. Down a little water. Give me this. Wall shelves. Don't mind if I do. We're not hurt. Does this carry all got anything in it? I, I mean, I'm aware that my inventory is full. I just want it's empty. Okay. All right, let's go steal the captain's booze then. This is the whole reason I came. The captain's booze is the entire reason I'm here. Cabin 2 is locked, but doesn't have an opening. Notes to self. 1806 is Yu's birthday. Alright, one, eight. There's no zero, though. Well, that can't possibly be right. There's no zero on the thing. 1806. How do we make a zero, though? Because there's, there's no zero in the keypad, chat. Maybe it's 1441? One, four, one? No, that, it's got to be like this. It's all fancier phase gates. Are we trying to exhaust the galaxy or just our shelves? There's no zero. Not it. A six one eight. There's no zero though. Eastern Bandit, hey, welcome to the stream. Long time no see. What's up, bro? One four four four. Maybe the captain liked to play U four. Nope. Nope. I mean that. Yeah. There's no. There's no zero here, and all of these have a zero in it. I don't think you can get into it. I'm seventy percent sure you get it via radio broadcast. I, I'm inclined to agree. I don't think we can get in there. There, uh, Nothing with a zero is going to work because there's no zero. See, Chad, I told you people were too, like, cautious about password safety in the future to let it be that easy. I told you. It's too easy. What is this? Oh, it's just a stupid nutrient block. Reverse what, though? Like, it, it, there's still no zero on the keypad, and there's still the zero in the number, and it's not like we can mirror read it, because zero backwards is also still zero, chat. You can never go wrong with giving a number pad 42. That's probably just a general video game rule, because most video game devs would be the kind of folks who tend to enjoy Douglas Adams. You're probably not wrong. We all know the captain would have used his birthday if the number pad had a zero. So you're saying the captain was saved from his own idiocy just by virtue of the fact that they didn't bother to put a zero on a number pad. Which, by the way, code key lock designers, that's just terrible design, though, right? Like, you put a zero on the pad. Seems like not having a zero is a sort of a critical oversight. All right, let's get out of here. I am stuck, though. Around the electricity. Around the electricity, though. I hate these pipes. I'm straight up stuck. We can go around the back. And we get out like this way. Okay. 
I don't think we've been here before, Chad. Have we been in here? Oh, we've been in here. Yep, never mind. This is the way we came in. We chopped through this door. We already opened this. So this is the data coil room where we... This is the lab. We go up here. We should be able to jump out here, and I think we're I think we're done at the Aurora. Like I think we've stolen everything there's possible to steal. It's a good point. Wouldn't adding a zero add like an extra thousand variations? Pretty much, yeah. So I think we got to go stash all this sweet swag we got, and our next bit is going to be to build the sea moth. We got to get the materials for and build a sea moth. That's our new goal. That really expands our horizons from an exploratory standpoint. So let's get the hell out of here and try not to die. Our inventory is full, so there's no advantage into not just hauling ass straight back. To Why is the water shaking, though? Whatever is powerful enough to shake water like that, I don't want to be anywhere near it. Because water is fucking heavy as shit, and if you can shake water like that, that indicates a source of unimaginable power. What the hell is this? Uh, like, I don't remember this being here. Excuse me, life pod 4. I'd ask if you're doing okay, but you're clearly not doing okay. Who left you like this? Open a data box. Creature decoy. Attracts creatures to its location. It can be deployed by hand or submarine. Cannot be reclaimed once. Huh. We got a new thing. That's cool. I don't remember this being here at all some chairs oh you know what i wonder can we deconstruct the fabricators and whatnot on this and take them back to our base life pod four crew log we got to try that all right we got to re somebody remember where this is it's like right in front of the aurora okay we're gonna come back and see if we can dismantle its uh fabrication thing and then dismantle maybe it's medical bay as well and then we can take those back and install them in our base 